Hey everybody, Melissa here. So today I'm in LibreOffice and I want to show you how to use the clone formatting tool. Now what this allows us to do is very quickly copy and paste formats from one place to another by just a couple clicks of the mouse. So I'm going to show you in Calc, Writer, and Impress how to use this clone formatting tool. So let's go ahead and get started in Calc. So I have column A here that has numbers that are formatted as currency with a dollar sign and two decimal places. Now row two has the same formatting except for it's highlighted. And let's say I want these exact formats to carry over to the items I have in B and C. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna highlight these two and I'm going to click on my clone formatting. And then I'm gonna left click and highlight all of this and then let go. And look what happened. It carried the exact formatting that we copied over here to clone. So that's how it works in Calc. Let's move over to Writer. So I have some text here that says good morning with three exclamation points and it's underlined. And then I have a sentence down here that's in a completely different font. Now let's say that I want to carry the font and the underline down to this sentence. So I'm going to highlight here and I'm going to do clone formatting. Now let's just say I click here. Watch what happens. It just did that last word. That's not what we want it to do. We want it to get the entire sentence. So I'm going to hit back and I'm going to go back and get my formatting again. What we want to make sure we do is highlight the entire sentence that we want done and then it grabs it all and it changed the font and then it made it an underline so it matches this exactly. So that's how you do it in Writer. Let's go look at Impress. So in Impress, I want to take this formatting and I want to copy it to this Welcome to the Presentation because they're completely different. So let's highlight it and let's click on our clone formatting and let's just click. So did you notice that in Libre Impress, you just have to click where you want it instead of highlighting it because of course Impress is in sections and not a continuous document or continuous row cells. So clone formatting can be used on just about any type of formatting out there. Bold, italics, underline, color, paragraphs, bullets, anything like that. So don't hesitate to use it because it will save you quite a bit of time. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more content like this in the future, please be sure to subscribe to my channel before you go. And I'll see you in the next tutorial. Until then, thanks so much for watching.